Hey y'all, this is a Variety Kid. So, um, uh, right now I'm actually at my grandparents' house in Pennsylvania where they're for vacation. So as y'all may have known, either because, um, uh, I met some people there or because we, or because I told y'all about it, um, uh, I went to this block party, or, or they called it a block party, it was hosted at a church, um, uh, nearby, um, uh, it was like a block party, but, but, but however, I went there. Um, uh, and in this video, I am going to, um, uh, talk about my experience there. So, um, uh, you know what, I, I wanted to say this before I started, I was going to say, so first of all, it was, even if it wasn't hosted as a, at a block, as I said earlier, it, it kind of was like one, because it had a lot of things like it, like there were a lot of, like, fun games, and there were inflatables, those, those were the two big things that made it like it, and there was a lot of good, pretty good food there. Um, uh, but anyways, um, uh, let's get into it. Okay, so, whenever I first got there, um, uh, I decided to go find people, like, closer to my age, as there were a lot of really young kids. But I, but however, like, whenever I found some kids, we were doing this game where we, um, uh, or, or, um, uh, or, or the group I was in was doing this game where we, um, uh, mm, I don't know what the game is called, it's a fairly common game, but we like, um, uh, or, or there were many different teams, and we all, so we all ran with a sponge to a water bucket, um, uh, to empty the sponge, and whoever emptied the most water, um, uh, when the game ended, went, or won, I'm sure you've heard of that game, but, um, uh, yeah, that's where I started, and then, at one point, I met, um, I, or, or I met, like, or I met quite a few different people, but, I don't know, I was gonna say, so I met two people there that knew me from other places, um, uh, there was this, first of all, there was this kid named Will, um, uh, I met him at this camp called Frontier Camp in Grapeland, Texas, I'll, I'll tell you more about, like, what, or I'll tell you more about our conversation about that in a little bit, but I also, and I also met this girl named Michaela from a Christian private school I went to in 7th through ninth grade, I from what I remember, I met her in 8th grade, uh, or I met her when I was in 8th grade, she's a few years younger than me, so, um, uh, she was in, like, 6th grade or something whenever she met me, um, uh, but however, um, uh, I was gonna say, anyways, going back to Will, so, I, I just find this conversation pretty funny, I was gonna say, um, uh, so he said, hey, I met you at Frontier Camp, like, 12 years ago, and then I told him, no, or, and then I said, no, there's, no, or, or, it must, no, there's no way, it must have been a different person, because I didn't go to Frontier Camp in 2010, and then I asked him if, and then, I, and then I should have started, decided to figure out exactly what year it was, so, I started off by asking him, hey, did we go in that cabin that was on top of a basketball court, which is what we did in 2014, and he said, no, we didn't, but he did say I mentioned it to him. And then this is the part that I just really like telling. So I asked him about like, okay, so so or or so when or 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 so I asked him about okay, so when we were at camp, did this experience happen to you where a counselor yelled "shut up" and then I sang "Hey, I dance with me" and then he said <laughs> and then he said that that happened. Yeah, I know. I find that experience really funny. Um, uh, yeah. Um, I, and, and the people at the cabin found it pretty funny as well. Anyway. I actually did a lot of different things there with a lot of different people. I'll, I'll mention some other people that I met there um, uh, later on. But however, I was going to say at one point, I asked Will how old he was. He said, so first of all, he said um, uh, 18, but he later corrected himself to say um, uh, 19, as he just turned 19. I don't know if I said this right away. I may have actually said first that he looks at least 21, but however, um, uh, or, or I know at one point in our conversation, he said, I told, like, I, I don't know, like, like, it may have been after telling him that he, he looks at least 21, but at least at one point I said, you look at least old enough to drink, and I, kn I know at one point, like, I may have said that multiple times, but I know at least one time he re responded to that by saying, well, I am old enough to drink. God's law doesn't say you have to be 21 to drink, which I really found pretty funny. And I also made a joke of, or and I also made a joke agreeing with, or and I also made a joke agreeing with him. By saying that, um, I... That according to God's law, there's nothing against giving a baby alcohol, which I found funny.
funny. I mean, even though that would be pretty unwise and the baby probably wouldn't be able to handle it, though. Anyways, um, uh, I was going to say one of the other people I met there was Riley. Him and Will actually knew each other. Or I believe Riley said he met Will at a, um, at a graduation party. I was going to say, I did hang out with other oh, people. From what I remember, like, I, I mostly remember things I did with Will and Riley. Um, uh, but however, I was going to say, so some other things we did and there were, and there were probably, and there were other, there were probably other people with us, but some other things we did is we played Gaga ball. Um, uh, and I actually went through this inflatable. Um, uh, I did it three times with Riley. I was going to say, I got one of them recorded. Or I was going to say the first time that we went through the inflatable, um, uh, he said, you only want to race me if you like losing. And I ended up actually winning, which I find pretty funny that he like acted like I was go. He, he acted like he was really good and was going to win, but I actually ended up winning. Anyways, um, uh, here's a video clip of, um, um, uh, or here's a video of clip of me going through the um, uh, inflatable with Riley. other people I met. So there were three people, Will and Riley, as well as, um, uh, or as well as this other girl named Ava. Those were the three people that I got phone numbers from. Um, uh, anyways, I, I mean, I, I did talk to Ava a lot. I mean, I talked a lot about, like, her siblings and stuff like that. Or I was gonna say, I, I just feel like mentioning it, even though it was, uh, even though it was really a really minor event, but I was going to say Ava that did seem pretty friendly and interested in talking to me. I was gonna say, the first thing, or I was going to say, like, the first, like, one of the first things she asked me, um, uh, after I met her was what my favorite color was, which I just felt like mentioning just because it sound like, seemed like, um, uh, she was interested in talking to me and I did enjoy talking to her. Um, uh, and then she was with some other friends. I don't remember all of them. Um, or I know one of her friends with her was named, um, uh, Becca. Um, I believe I talked to her a little bit, but I don't really remember very much about what we talked about. Anyway, so there's actually, um, uh, two more things, or at least two more things that I can think of right now that I want to, um, uh, tell you. So, I actually played some nine square. I don't know, I don't remember with who. From what I remember, there were at least nine people there, given that I remember all nine spots being used. And then, um, I was gonna say, so I actually met another person from, from the Christian private school that I previously went to. His name was Colby. He's actually a few years older than me. I don't know how old exactly he is. I mean, I, my last year was in ninth grade, so he may have graduated when I, or like, or, or like once I got to ninth grade. And then this was more in the middle, but I was gonna say, or I actually realized there was another kid I met, or, or I met from the Christian private school I went to. Um, uh, yeah, I actually don't remember his name. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'd like it if you could leave a like if you enjoyed it and possibly tell me about, like, your feedback on the video or any part that you really liked hearing about. Um, I hope to be posting soon. Um, again, I have a video idea about what I want to do next. Um, uh, I'll give you a hint. It's about a topic I've never actually mentioned before. Um, uh, yeah, and I hope to get, and I hope to get that posted soon, but anyways, I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!